Hello, welcome Capricorn. Welcome to Maji the Priestess channel. Today we're going to be doing your reading for 2022 of January. Okay, so Capricorn, I know you're watching this right now. I just want to say happy birthday to my Cappies out there. Okay, sending you tons of love and light. Spirit says um, this could be for any Capricorn in any placement in your chart. But I am hearing rising sign, but you know, take it if you have it in any placement in your chart. Please remember, this is a general reading. If it doesn't resonate, okay, um, do not take the message. Only take it if it resonates and only take what resonates, all right? Um, don't forget to comment down below. Like this video if it resonates. Um, my Cash App and PayPal is down below if you would like to donate anything to the channel, okay? And yeah, let's just start. So I just split the deck and we have the Six of Wands, all right? And before starting this video, I did hear something like, unexpected all right something could go viral something could be going unexpected i'm hearing there's some type of good luck in the air for you um capricorn in the month of uh january of 2022 okay just like my little painting right here um something major is gonna happen here cap all right i'm also getting the nine of pentacles so you could be single right now or trying to buy a home trying to gain your independence um what was that other card i saw well, let's just get at it, right? I'm just getting like something is changing, something impactful. We do have the six of wands. So you're getting some type of victory in something or success. Let's see what the ancestor spirit guides have to say. Spirits, I ring the bell. All right. Now, ancestor spirit guides of the highest white light. What is the message here for Capricorn during the month of January 2022? What is to be expected for Cappies? We have the justice card coming out, Libra. So you could be dealing with a Libra, okay? Or you're getting some type of justice. I don't know if you are. Yeah, there's some type of wish fulfillment coming towards you, Cap. So you're getting you're getting justice for something, all right? Something that was imbalanced is going to be balanced into your life. If you're dealing with a court case or some type of legal issue, I'm hearing things are going to go in your favor, okay? So take that message if it resonates. Spirit says that's the truth, okay? You're going to get some type of clarity here. Yeah, it's like you're being asked to take a leap of faith in something. Let's see. Ancestor Spirit, guys, what is the message for Capricorn here in the month of January 2022? I told you there is success. There's the chariot. You may purchase a new car or something like that. Okay, I'm getting, yes, yeah, six of wands. Yeah, you're moving. Somebody's moving here. There's some type of change or transformation coming towards you. A wish fulfillment, Cappy. Beautiful energy. Um, definitely with the six of swords. You may have you may have kids yourself, but I see your spirit guides are guiding you to move on from something. Okay, I'm seeing you driving, relocating, some of you overseas. I'm not sure, okay, but you're moving for sure. What is the message here for Capricorn in the month of January 2022? Yes, that's what it was. Yeah, you're 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 celebrating something. It's if you were having some type of money issue here, I'm getting like there's this your ships are coming in. Um, you're no longer gonna have some type of money issue. I'm hearing like just remain confident. We have the page of swords with the three of cups so you are celebrating something i feel like you have people that are watching you <coughs> or a particular person could be a libra since it's on the libra we also have cancer in the house take what resonates what's this page of swords who's watching happy yeah somebody's stressing about you right now the seat okay this is somebody that's being deceitful They're, they might be trying to mess with your sleep or um this is somebody that you had to heal from a heartbreak yeah five of swords okay so yeah, there's some envy, jealousy around you. I really didn't want to tap into this energy, Ten of Cups. Um, it's like you're about to have some sort of happiness, some type of success. Use your discernment at this time, Capricorn, is what is being recommended. It's like people are watching you, you're being celebrated, but there's definitely envy, jealousy, deceit around you. There's a snake, there's a false, I heard false prophet, I don't know. There's somebody false around you. Um, this person may bring you anxiety or they're under a lot of stress and anxiety as they're watching you um, blow up, succeed, something like that. We'll get more into it. What's the Seven of Swords, Five of Swords for Cappy? The Knight of Wands. Yeah, it may have something to do with your money because this is you. You're going into your boss status here, okay? It's like you're going towards your passions. Yeah, the sun, exactly. Leo energy. Heavy Leo energy with the strength, okay? You may have Leo in your chart. I'm getting like, excuse me, with this Leo energy, um, 
you're definitely about to shine bright I told you somebody here is buying a new home relocating um there is a celebration some of someone here may attend a wedding i heard but i'm getting like they're being illuminated whoever these people are they're being illuminated somebody's very jealous of your success your happiness that's the truth says spirit all right you're, you're gonna get clarity into who this person is because i see you moving on starting from zero the star card like i said you're shining bright like a diamond right you're shining bright like a diamond you're coming up as a star so people are viewing you as the star in 2022 of january you're no longer going to be in the stuck energy i'm also hearing stop holding on to your gifts it's time to share them whoever left you out in the cold is going to feel regret for leaving you out in the cold all right um yeah so definitely i see a new opportunity coming towards you here cap there's a new opportunity here that's going to make you very very happy this is something that you've been working on the empress the eight of wands and the seven of cups so this felt right on the empress right so you're coming up as a divine feminine here right you're highly ranked in spirit you're coming up as a divine feminine things are shifting for you the energy is gaining momentum um you're manifesting something could be a message could be some good news yeah i just said you're manifesting something and the magician came out so a fact here oh okay the magician fell under the seven of swords so this gives me like somebody is doing some type of spell work or magic here. Um, could be on your finances or on your mood since that's the sun. I don't know. Um, I'm hearing like just stay confident, optimistic because everything is working out for you overall. Somebody's just mad. Yeah, you're going through some type of transformation, Scorpio, Gemini, Libra. Okay. There is love in the cards too. It seems that there's a relationship that wants to enter your life. Somebody wants to apologize for making you an option here. Trying to confuse you. Something about family keeps coming up with that four of wands. Or if you're married, then your marriage. Alright, I'm changing cards. Let's clarify with the mini tarot here. Five of cups. Somebody's sad. Alright, somebody's deep in their emotions. That's the truth. Yeah, you're definitely going to have some sort of victory and clarity here, okay? Somebody could be doing death spells on you. Yeah, this fell under the Magician and the Seven of Swords. It could be a Scorpio, could be a Gemini. The lovers, okay? So there is love in the cards. Like I said, Gemini energy. You may have to make a decision upon this between two lovers or... Yeah, I told you, somebody's practicing magic. Didn't make it up. Seven of Swords, the Magician. It's there right there twice, just to clarify. The same cards twice. So there you go. There's somebody secretly competing with you. They're competitive. They're just jealous. They're envious of your success. They're jealous of people celebrating you or you celebrating something here. I feel like you could have already moved on from this person with the Empress card here. You could be pregnant or... Um, giving birth yeah i feel like you're giving birth to an idea here and it's going to be a blessing and it's going to bring you success but somebody here might be celebrating like a baby shower i'm hearing or something like that definitely some dark magic here is being practiced yeah three of cups and the tower this could be a group of people doing this with the tower that shit is going to backfire and i'm hearing like i said you're going to have some type of sudden success here capricorn all right you're going to have some type of sudden success where people are going to have to celebrate you whether they like it or not. I'm seeing a lot of people celebrate you. You could be going to like some sort of celebration or party here. Um, but yeah, whoever tried to do this magic on you is going to backfire. The chariot is here twice, Cancer. All right, so it's like you're either buying a new car or you're moving. You're getting success, victory, and something here. The high priestess fell into the magician. So you're the alchemist here. You could be a high priestess tower reader, but I'm getting like people are searching, looking you up here, Capricorn. Um, listen to your intuition about this person. Yeah, five of cups. Somebody feels some type of regret here. Just listen to that intuition of yours. It's telling you who it is. All right, ten of swords. Everything is fine. This is somebody that has betrayed you or is planning to stab you in the back. All right. The devil. This is you, Cappy, the devil, Capricorn. But right now, the devil's coming up as somebody very toxic around you. They could be doing some type of binding spell, manipulation. Yeah, six of wands with the justice. All right, so either way, none of that matters because you're about to receive justice and success. Six of wands is here twice. So literally, if you're in the public eye, you're going to be getting more success, more subscribers, more fans, um, more whatever of whatever you're doing here. Okay? 
um, heavy Libra here. The justice is here twice. So your ancestors, your spirit guides, they're giving you justice because they've noticed that there's this demonic energy around you. This may this 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 person or people may be trying to do depression spells, so you feel kind of sad and depressed and low vibrational. Okay, I'm getting like there's a lot of low vibrational energies around you. Heavy witchcraft. Listen to your intuition, to your guides. Yeah, these people are watching you. Okay, I'm hearing like they can't keep their eyes off you. Ten of, ten of swords again. They're planning to betray you, or they could be doing those death spells, like I said. They're watching you online on their phone, and they're miserable. Okay, whoever this is, they're watching you on their phone, and they're just mad and miserable. That's the truth. Ace of swords, that's the truth. Yeah, you left this person out in the cold or something, and they may be trying to slow down something. What's the six of wands? Yeah, this could be somebody you grew up with, with the six of cups, or somebody from your past. Okay. Yep, this person is heavy stressing you right now. They're heavily stressed that you're winning is what I'm getting. Even though this isn't a competition, they believe it is. What's the six of wands with the justice? So you're, 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 their karma, okay, their karma is going to be to watch you succeed. And your good karma is to succeed, all right? It's to get some sort of victory and success here. It's to be on this high horse, getting recognition, people loving you, celebrating you, okay? So it's like, clarify the six of wands here for Cap. Yeah, somebody may be trying to, like, argue or bring drama into your life. What's this Six of Wands for Cappy? For January here? King of Wands. You're taking action here. Yeah, something you've been working on. And, yeah, look at this. You're closing out a cycle here with a relationship or a love. Could have been with a Leo. Um, I'm seeing here the strength and the wheel of fortune. Okay, something is in your destiny here. Yeah. I don't know if you're planning to travel or something like that. You could be meeting somebody while you travel. I'm seeing heavy water. I see um, if you have been waiting on some type of like twin flame situation, okay, or something like that. This person is getting ready to close out a cycle. You're starting over with a new relationship here. What's this two of cups for Cap? Yeah, the sun. I keep saying it. Heavy Leo, okay? And look at that moon, Cancer. There's a lot of things being hidden from you right now, from these enemies here. There is a dark entity. You may feel it around you. Um, this person may want to, like, they make, they're doing, yeah, three, three of pentacles. They're doing spell work on you for sure, and they're paying somebody to do it. What three of pentacles I am getting like? They could be paying somebody, like a wish doctor, that's the truth. Or it could be three people. Look at that ace of pentacles. So they could be trying to block this blessing coming towards you, but they can't block it, okay? They can't block it. Whatever. Either way, the sun is right there under the moon. We got the moon, the sun, and the stars. So something is coming into alignment with your astrology chart. And I'm also getting that whatever was in the dark is going to come to light. It's going to be exposed. Ooh, ace of cups. Beautiful. There is love in the house. There's a brand new love coming towards you. I see you went into some type of heartbreak. There could have been a third party situation. This person may close out a situation to come towards you. For others of you, if you're single, somebody broke your heart. I see new love coming towards you, especially self-love. I feel like you brought love into yourself, but um, there's a th three of swords here. And here's the Empress. Again, you're coming up as the Empress Capricorn. You're one of a kind. You're above all the queens. Okay, King of Cups. Yeah, somebody is secretly in love with you here. They want to offer you something, but they may feel like they don't have enough to offer you. Ooh, look at that right there. Five of wands, seven of wands. There's definitely jealousy competition around you. Literally, your spirit guides are protecting you energetically from all this BS that's going on. Because there's like, literally could be siblings, rivalry, friends, co-workers, could be anybody. But I see like five people here, they're all fighting, competing. And like, you're fighting these people. Right, you're fighting these people, but you're coming out on top, right? You always win. You're coming out on top. There is a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Doesn't have to be, okay? This person is deeply in love with you and they're heartbroken, okay? If this person had to make a decision, they're choosing you. They're closing out a cycle. I see a lot of happiness in your love life in 2022 either way, so. And Spirit is saying this people could be your own family with the Ten of uh, Pentacles, Okay. This could be your own family that's doing this to you. Yeah, Virgo energy here with the Scorpio and the Ace of Pentacles again. Okay, so <clears throat> I see you ending something and there's a new lover coming in. 
you're going through some type of transformation. Like I said, it's like you went hermit mode. You're not talking to people or people are like trying to open up their laptops and like look you up. I see like people looking you up on their laptops. So you may have a platform and an online something going on here. All right. Let's look into your finances or anything else Spirit wants to say for Capricorn in January 2022. Yeah, you're moving up. You're leveling up to the to a boss level here. You're about to become a boss. You could already be, but you're moving on to a next level. Say it says your finances haven't improved yet, but you can certainly believe that they will. So your finances are going to improve, Capricorn. Okay. There is going to be peace. I see you leveling up in some sort of way. All right. You're about to make, yeah, you're moving on to your next level in your finances. Ooh, it's in the air, says spirit. If something was unclear, it's going to be clear. We have growth. Expect good news and money matters. A race. A race or a new job offer okay so this could be a new job offer but for some of you it could be a race you may be coming your own boss or your boss may give you a race take it what resonates I do see that there's promising opportunities that await for you I see your money growing okay for sure I see you're focused on your money yeah there's people around you that are doing things unethical is what I hear what else for Kathy we have Outlook Improve your relationship with money to help you grow. Yeah, it's it, that's what you're doing. You're improving your relationship with money because it's like this is somebody that's in lack. Maybe it, before you used to believe in lack, you didn't have enough, so you were saving or you were working a nine to five. But I see you finally like sharing your gifts, sharing your talent. You're coming up as the empress and the star. So you're beautiful, you're gorgeous, you're sexy, you're handsome. You've grown up a lot here, okay? Um, yeah, some of you guys could have a child here. Your outlook on money is going to change because you're, you're going to see your money grow and you're going to see you leveling up, okay? Spend time on earth and ground your energy also. Last messages for Capricorn. Some of you guys watching here could be a student, okay? You could be in college. You could be in high school. I don't know. You could be a student. Um, or you may, you may be encouraged to go back to school to learn something, maybe about finances or something like that. We have unrealistic. All right, so Spirit is saying some of your visions here are unrealistic, so make sure that you ground your energy and you read and you get more knowledge. Stop dreaming in your head. It's good to dream big, but, you know, you kind of have to take action here, right? Yeah, you have a gift. You have a gift here, Capricorn, that's coming to you. There's going to be some sort of gift. Somebody's going to give you money. This, look at this birthday cake. This could be on your birthday. This looks like a birthday cake. All right, somebody might give you a gift, lend you money, or help you in some way, it says here. You could get a cash bonus at work as well. And then we have leadership. And look at that crown. You're being crowned for something. Somebody tried to take your crown off, replace you, but they couldn't do that. You can expect to succeed in any leadership position. So you're about to be in a leader here. Yeah, and there's luck. There's luck on your side, okay? Jupiter energy. Um, you're moving up to the next level. You're being called to lead, right? It's time to step up into that role. Your finances will greatly improve once you accept and step into this power. You have a gift here, like I said, with the star. You're going to need to share it, and you have luck on your side. So what else, right? Some of you guys, like I said, are parents, or you want to be parents, and you're going to be. I see a child here. All right, let me give you an oracle, and then I'll let you go, Cappy. Last message for Capricorn. Yeah, you're getting your milk and honey, my love. You're getting that wish fulfillment, milk and honey, the rainbows. You could be seeing that. You're about to be literally emotionally fulfilled, regenerated, renewed, rebirth. You're not the same who you used to be. You are you have a deep knowing now. And yeah, look, the fates, the star. Something is fated to happen here, whether it's you being in the public eye, you showing the world who you are. You have some sort of blessing that needs to be seen in the world, Capricorn, please. Higher power. You are highly connected to the spiritual world. You're highly connected to God, to angels, to higher power, okay? To source. You have a deep knowing, so you are a high priestess here for sure. Um, it's time to use that wisdom, that inner knowing, okay? Um, because you're being called to do something that's fated for you. It's like you're a star. You're anointed, okay? Cappy, you are anointed. And some people are mad and jealous about that, but you're closing out cycles. That shit does not matter. You are elevating. You are ascending. And so it does not matter. And like I said, this King of Cups might express their emotions for you. Somebody's making a move. They're coming towards you. 
all right this is all i have for you capricorn if this message resonated don't forget to like share and subscribe if you would like to donate my cash at paypal is down below if you would like to send me something through my p.o box it's also posted down below thank you so much happy birthday and happy new year capricorn the best only for my cappies out there in 2022 okay you are the star my love you get the attention you are the main show so be confident you've done your healing believe in yourself okay um follow that deep knowing that deep wisdom that you have here i'm also seeing 444 four, four. do not worry you are protected okay stand your ground you are protected there comes victory there comes success many blessings to you Cappy. bye bye